Okay, hey. I have showered and eating eight. Um, now I'm going to run some errands. Then I'm going to sit myself down and study in the car. It's good when I study in the car because I can't go anywhere. If I'm at home, I pop up and down, find things to do, run back and forth to the restroom, bathroom, grab a snack, you know. So studying at home just doesn't work well for me. Um, but I still have a surprise to show you guys. Talk to you in a minute. Hey guys, I have my book and right here in the car. And I am going to study. I do have a problem with my eye. I don't know what that is going on over here. I can feel it. I have a problem with this left hand that's been really, I mean, this finger is so weak and it's not like I've been crocheting a lot and things like that. And, um, you know, I don't know, maybe it's just all the stress that um, I've been around that, um, these last few months, all this has happened, like my um, chin is growing more hair. Anybody know about that? I mean, super fast and um, just things, little weird things that was not happening. But anyway, I, I, I am going to study now. So I'll talk to you in a minute and I will show you the surprise later. This is Jones Blues and Jam. My big surprise. I'm going to show you guys. Okay. This is my traveling van. I had to buy a big pillow because, um, oh, I wanted to be able to see over the dashboard. New seat covers over here. And there it sits eight this one I'm going to take out this down this is the one that my grandson I'll put him in when I pick him up and it is and this stuff here is just my stuff I'm going to pull the carpet out because if you can see how filthy it is I've vacuumed it washed it with wiped it down with bleach did everything and I'm going to take it out because it smells like dog. Um, it doesn't look like dog, it looks more like coffee and grind. And I'm going to climb over the seat. This is the front seat here. But anyway, this will be my traveling van. And you guys will see me hopefully traveling. The United States in this van and I prayed or meditated over the matter and first I was going to call it Shelly because that's what my dad used to call me even though my name is Shirley he always called me Shelly but then after meditating over it and saying well and what came to me was grace because grace is going to take me where I need to go. Grace is going to be with me on the road. And grace have held on to me all this time. So, this is going to be called grace. And let me show you. This is the, uh, we have this here. It's pretty big. There's a seat, another seat right here. But I'm going to pull this carpet up today I'm gonna start my granddaughter is working with me that's the best way I can put the seat covers on I still need to they were a little bit big that's my sweater a little bit big but it's starting to begin I had it checked out by the mechanic prior to um want to move prior to buying it it has a lot of miles on it a hundred and 94 miles, but it's a Honda.
and I should be able to get at least 200,000 miles on it if I keep up the maintenance on time because he said it is a good car. I got what work done I needed to. Let me turn you around. Jones Blues and Jam. I'm just doing a quick update. I made it to my doctor's appointment. You know, that's a monthly appointment. He said, I seem to be doing very well, which I know because of you guys and because of um, being able to document uh, a lot of what's going on in my life. A lot of the times, most of the times I make videos, but I don't put them up. But just making the video actually help because I make it and I look back and look at it after I make it and think, hmm, you know, then I'll race it or I might keep it, you know, for later reference. I don't know. Um, you, you, you don't know, but I'm just glad that, you know, he saw the progress. I feel the progress and um, so I'm, I'm happy, you know. Um, that I'm, I'm making progress and not going backwards and not staying in one spot. And I hope for all those people out there who have lost someone that they love that they'll be able to find a, um, a place where they can move forward some kind of um, relief that will allow them to move forward also in whatever the grief that they're going to the lost.